Hey guys, what is up? Red Mining here. Hi guys, all doing? Hope you're doing really well and have a really great day. In this video, I just want to talk to you all about LOL Miner, which I think is the best LHR software that has just come about and it's been working really great on all of my LHR cards that I have right now, whether it's the 3060s, 3070 Ti, 3080 Ti. It seems to be working the best out of all the other ones that I've tested so far. NB Miner, G Miner, it's, they've all been inconsistent for me. But ever since LOL Miner just came out, just recently, six days ago, a new update, uh, LOL Miner 1.33, this one has definitely been running a lot better. And I will show you guys a uh, the share rate and an example rig on Ethermine here and how much shares we got and... Uh, how it's been really good okay so let me just go explain first lol miner he recently made a massive change or update here core feature complete rework of lhr semi unlock feature so he says your better performance of lhr semi unlock about 70 percent plus on gddr6x cards uh, 3070 ti 3080 ti which i'll show you guys my hash rates for those in a second about 71 to 72 percent on gddr6 so 3060 ti 3070 uh, i wish i had these cards i do not have a 3060 TI or 3070 LHR yet. I, I will. Coming soon. 81% on 3060 LHR V1 with the right drivers earlier than 460.39. Uh, recommended driver for LHR V2 470.74. So this actually made a big difference when I did the NVIDIA dash driver dash update in Hive OS to the 470.74 driver and all of my NVIDIA cards are now behaving much better. So Example, I have a LHR rig here with two 3060s. Uh, one is a LHR V1 and another one's LHR V2. And then I have a 3080 Ti and then a 3070 Ti. So these are all LHR cards. And then you can see here, I can get about 33 to 34 mega hash on the 3060s. And then I'm getting 70 to 71 mega hash on the 3080 Ti, okay, at about 260 watts, which seems quite high. But I've talked about before, this 3080 Ti that I have specifically is, I, I don't know if it's like another LHR revision or something, but I can't get over 71, 72 mega hash on this 3080 Ti for the life of me. And I try to see if there's a BIOS update for it on NO3D, but there's nothing. There's nothing for it. If you guys have heard anything, let me know down below because I've seen 3080 Ti's go up to like 85 mega hash. Anyway, going along guys, I have a 3070 Ti as well getting about 54 to 55 mega hash and this card, the, this EVGA for the Win 3 has been working really well with LOL Miner. You can see generally when I had like, I can show you like, I wish I had a screenshot of NB Miner, but it was all over the place. It was just going nuts. But LOL Miner is a little bit more consistent and the hash rates are staying this way. And now I want to show you another rig that I have here. It's a, a full-on 3060 LHR V2s, okay? Using LOL Miner about 21 hours ago or about 20 hours ago uptime now. Uh, you can see how LOL Miner 1.33, 100% accepted share rate. And now I want to show you the exact uh, at, at the pool, okay? So... This is something I was wondering about, just basically, you know, how the average uh, reported hash rate and uh, it looks like average past six hours, according to Ethermine, says 140 mega hash. So that that's pretty good. All right. So that's over the uh, let's see what uh, I'm actually getting on uh, Hive OS here. So if I refresh, I'm getting about 135 mega hash for the whole rig. OK, uh, in Hive OS and then going back to Ethermine. It shows reported 135.6. So pretty much exactly that. But the biggest thing here is what I was wondering regarding was the shares. Okay, so the most important thing, the submit the submission of shares going to Ethermine. So generally looking at these numbers, yes, they are pretty on point. Uh, also comparing it to maybe 1660s or maybe RX 580s that do, you know, 30, 30 to 32 mega hash that, you know, generally the share rate ranges from each GPU, okay, about 25 to 35 shares per hour. Okay, so this is on a per hour basis and I just wanted to verify it is by a per hour basis. Okay, number of valid shares submitted during the last hour. 
Okay, so you do 116 divided by four of these uh, 3060s, then that's how you that's how many shares uh, you can do the calculation there. So it's it's definitely outputting the correct shares, comparing it to other GPUs that I have. Okay, so that's that's really good. So LOL Miner is working really great for this LHR V2 mining rig it's been going really good so yeah i'm gonna i'm definitely gonna have to recommend lol miner version 1.33 that just came out and so i uh, yeah I, that's it that's that's what this video is about guys that's all i want to talk to you all about i have been hearing from some other people that the lol miner 1.33 has been acting a lot better on their lhr cards so yeah i've definitely moved away from nb miner uh looks like they did update it about 13 days ago for lhr mode for ergo all right, so I think that's still one of the first miners that still have the uh, that have the ergo unlocking the LHR for ergo. So that's that's pretty cool on NB miner. I personally have not tested it out yet. I've just kept my cards on uh, on Ethereum. But going along, uh, G miner also had one six days ago. They they said they improved auto tune for LHR GPUs. Now I haven't tried this, but I I do recall trying earlier versions that uh, it, it was just hit and miss. My, my cards would continuously be calibrating every time. And also with NB Miner as well. My 3070 Ti's and 3060's would be calibrating like just non-stop. But with this new LOL Miner, it has not been calibrating per se. The hash rates have generally been, it's been staying pretty consistent and stable. So I highly recommend this one. You guys should give it a try if you have not already. Uh, it's been, this is, a, this is a really good one. So thank you to Lolly Deb of LOL Miner. Awesome stuff. Okay, guys, I just want to end off with just a quick thing here of I just wanted to ask you all, you know, are you guys mining for profitability or are you mining your LHR cards on uh, Ethereum? So just for example, if I just did, you know, 3060 LHR on what to mine, I just hit calculate. You know, I do the past seven days profitability. It looks like Zeno Progpow Z is the most has been the most profitable uh, let's see here, 209, 207, yeah, it's, it's pretty close to Ethereum, like, we're talking about 9 cents off here, I mean, who's, who's counting, but honestly, generally, Ravencoin, Ethereum, Zeno, probably Ergo, Conflux, that looks like they're a little bit less, maybe we're talking 20, 30 cents less, but honestly, in terms of profitability, like, uh, what are you guys mining on your LHR cards right now? Uh, I told you guys what I'm doing, I'm still, I still have mine on Ethereum, but I know a lot of people out there have them on Ravencoin. I mean, I do have a rig on Ravencoin. Okay, I'm doing that test, 3070 Ti test, uh, for for those that have watched that video uh, a couple months or a couple a couple weeks back. So yeah, stay tuned for that. I I wonder how much profit that rig has made so far. Uh, that I will update you guys on another time. But yeah, I was just curious, just to end off here. Like, you know, there's been a lot of people talking that they're not using their LHR cards for Ethereum. Now, my 3070 Ti can get about 54. I'm going to hit calculate there. And 3070 Ti looks like past seven days is, wow, Ethereum is not even at the top of the chart here. It's like Equilibria, Rio, Rio. Wow, that's that's actually interesting. Oh, wow. That goes to show, like, I, I don't go to what to mine every day. It's like I never... I never check this every day, but it looks like, wow, Ethereum is not the most profitable coin on the 3070 Ti. So you can see, yeah, Ravencoin's been doing pretty well, but $3.37 as of recording, and then Equilibria or Rio, Rio is about $3.86. So that is interesting of itself, a lot of different things. So let me know what you guys are doing and why. I, I think I know, I've heard a lot of people do Ergo as well, as uh, Ergo seems to be pretty good on the LHR cards as well. Okay, my friends, thanks for watching. I appreciate you all. Let me know your thoughts. Have a good one and give LOL Miner a try. All right, guys, peace out.